What's up YouTube? Wanted to show you the break I made uh, to bend some steel garden border. The idea came to me after the local metal shop messed up my order and I figured I could mess it up myself for free. Here's how it works. I'm just using a little piece of aluminum for demonstration. You put what you're gonna bend in here. Cinch it down with the wing nuts and then where your brake or your bend's gonna be you line that up right on the the gap here and then you use the 2x4 for leverage and you make your bend and there we go So this is all stuff you could get at Lowe's or Home Depot. Uh, used a two by eight lumber, stacked stacked it here. Some strap hinges, framing angle, and this is more two by eight lumber. I cut this on a bevel, like a 45 ish. That way, sometimes you have to go past 90 to make a good 90, if you know what I mean. Uh, these are three eighths carriage bolts with some fender washers. And then I chiseled out a little bit out of the bottom here so that the carriage bolt head sits flush. And then use more framing angle to attach the 2x4 real good. The thing is, this needs pretty much two people to, to run because someone has to stand on here. A foot here and a foot there to give you the, the weight you need. Uh, so when my wife's home, we'll get her to stand on it and we'll do some bends. All right, so here's our 10 foot long piece of steel. It's a eighth inch thick. I think that's 11 gauge. Uh, I marked the line where we needed our bend to be. So I'm just kind of getting it all lined up and then we're cinching it down and let's give it a bend. All right, so we banged out seven or eight of these boxes today and uh, hit our groove after the first or second one, got the hang of it. Uh, definitely works better when the heavier person, that's me, uh, stands on the brake. And uh, yeah, real happy with it. It makes some, it makes some nice bends. Uh, I'm hoping this saves somebody some time or some money. Thanks for watching, peace.